Here's my selected app. Let's set the password and done. Here my app gets logged instantly. In this video, we'll be looking at the best way that you can use to lock apps on your iPhone. So firstly, there's no direct feature on the iPhone called as the app lock, but there's a way around it for sure. And I'll be showing you just that. So yeah, let's begin. So for that, now let's head over to the shortcuts app, which is right over here. Once we are here, you can see there's a bunch of options for us to choose from. Let's click on automation. From here, we'll click on create personal automation. And now let's scroll down till we find app. Let's click on it. So what we're doing here is basically setting up an app lock automation. So there's this option of choosing the app. So let me choose it. Let me go ahead and let's say lock my camera, lock the Chrome browser. Let me also scroll down. I'll also go ahead and lock my files app and my messages app for sure. So once you're done choosing the apps, let's click on done. Now also make sure that the is open button is also selected. Let's click on next. Once we're here, as you can see, it suggests me to add an action. So let's click on add an action. Let me now go ahead and search for start timer. Select it. And now we'll just go ahead and select the least amount of time which is possible. That is, we'll change these minutes to seconds. And I'll also change this 30 to 1. Let's click on next. Now also make sure to unselect this ask before running option. Let's click on don't ask over here. And finally, let's click on done. Now once we are done with this step, you're just one step closer in locking all of these apps on your iPhone. So for the last and final step, let's head over to the clock app. And now I'll just go over to the timer option over here. Make sure that this is set to one second and also ensure that the when timer ends option is also set to stop play. Let me go ahead and click on set and we are done with all the steps required to lock apps on your iPhone. For example, let's say I wish to open Chrome. Let me click on it and it gets locked just like that. And now to simply unlock it, I'll simply go ahead and enter my passcode. So yeah, I mean, it's that easy to lock multiple apps on your iPhone at once. Now I'm running the latest version of iOS on my iPhone, but this method does not require you to keep up to date version of the iOS as it can pretty much work on all the older versions as well. Now in the very same way, you can also use Face ID to unlock apps on your iPhone. If you haven't set up Face ID already, let's go to settings. Let me scroll down. Click on Face ID and Passcode. I'll just simply go ahead and enter my passcode. Once we are here, we'll click on Set up Face ID. Let's click on Get Started. So once my Face ID scan is complete, I'll click on Continue. And done. That's how you can set up your Face ID as well to unlock apps using Face ID on your iPhone. Let's try it out. Let's click on Chrome. And as you can see, I just use Face ID to unlock apps on my iPhone. So yeah, that was about the easiest way that you can use to lock any sort of apps on your iPhone. Do let me know if you found this video helpful. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And I'll see you in the next one.